Hey Jim, welcome back to Resident Evil 7, where we're on the band footage still. We're gonna do daughters. Brainstorm at the Baker Farm. Three years ago, the Bakers were like any other family. They just finished family dinner, listened to the raindrops hammer against the window panes as they ate. A moment of peace was something, something shenanigans. Last night I spent with my real family. Breaking news. In Must be news. CNN. Record-breaking rainfall from this week's hurricane looking to come to a close tomorrow morning as the storm moves on. Out in the Gulf, reports of a missing ship have rescue crews combing the coast. We'll have the details on that search shortly. But first, record rain over the Good past Lord. few days has left many residents in yeah. some of the parishes knee-deep in floodwaters. On radar, we can see the system moving along to the northeast, losing strength as it goes. And by tomorrow morning, we should be home Any free. Any news on the damage from the storm? Here in um. They haven't said. All right. Marguerite. Up. Up. Security Council passed a motion to keep aid workers stationed in oh. Edonia. Oh, she's so young. Yeah, how's our other guests? Sleeping, poor thing. Oh, I say let him. He'll be okay here for a few days, at least while it's to the in the town. Zoe, go get some fresh clothes from the laundry room, okay? Oh, looks like there's some sort of oil. What you typing in, in there? Let's get this poor girl some fresh clothes and into a warm bed. Mm. We'll put her in Lucas's old room. Oh, come on. Can't you put her somewhere else? Oh, Lucas, you just hush. Long up, girl. Put your guest bed in the trailer. I told her she could have the old bed. But she insisted. Get her to bed. I'll put some soup on. Good enough for soup, don't you think? Excuse me, Lucas. Zero one nine, huh? All right. One zero one nine. Remember that. We might need it. Get a change of clothes from the laundry room. There's a change of clothes in the laundry room, dear. Well, there's a laundry room at. Oh. She can't be in those dirty clothes all night. Not dirty, they're just wet. Back there, probably. Can you? Can't go, Mama. Come on, move. No, it's fine. Whenever you get around to it. Really? That car? There's nothing special about that car. It's a fucking SUV. Whatever. I won't do what you tell me. But I, but I won't do what you tell me. Gotta get some rage, rage against the machines then, it's just natural. Fix the upstairs windows, nail them some plywood, call the glass people later. Who gives his birthday present power tool? Ask Zoe about it. Okay, I don't know anything about it, but... Uh, 
And I guess I will take that. I love rainy nights. Those are the best. That's not good. We should probably board that up or something. Do you want water damage? This is how you get water damage. Alright. Locked from the other side, you say? Spent so much time in this creepy ass house. Turned into an all day event. Truly did turn into an all day event. All right, so we need something. To loosen some nails. I've got to sneeze. Okay, cut that out of my system. Mm. Buddy, please get her cleaned up and into some dry clothes. I need to check on the boathouse. It was half underwater last I looked. Yes, Daddy. Seems like a reasonable individual. He's also quick as ninja. Okay, so there's something out on the veranda. Nope. Alright then. Ain't nothing to it, but to do it. There you go, you little shit. All right, little girl. Let's get you cleaned up. They're mine now. What? <gasps> oh, for fuck's sake. Daddy? Is the power out? No. The power's on. Track? What do you think that giant flash fucking was? My god, woman. Not the uh, brightest bulb, is she? Oh. 
No, I don't have whatever goes in there. This isn't creepy as fuck. Yo, take one of them cue balls. You whack somebody upside the head with one of those, it gets work done. Just saying, no big. Take that fork. You ever hit a... or need to stab a bitch, fork will do it in a pinch. Work will do it in a pinch. Where'd that little girl get to? Little ninja. Burn that fucking drawer open. What was that? Oh, you tell me. You're the one that has the giant creepy house out in the fucking bayou. Question indeed. Lockpicks needing done. I'm assuming I'm gonna have to hide. Assumption. I will have to hide. Okay. So, well, I definitely opened this, so. Take the sturdy fucking rope.
Mm. What am I missing? Stairs or downstairs? So beautiful. Mama, is that you? Oh boy. Zoe, come look. Come see her gift. Oh boy. Look at all the pretties, my little girl is Kiss me, lover. <laughs> Get to the garage! Get to the garage! Go now! Oh, on it! Come on, get out of my way, Jack! <laughs> the girls are family now, and we're hers! Get out, woman! Get! Now don't you make me do something I regret? When Jack is the reasonable one in the relationship. I'm on my way, Daddy. Hold on. I'm coming. I mean, I'm sure shit goes south from here. Oh, shit. Jesus Christ. She wants me to do this. I have to show her how to hold her. She wants us all to show her our love. Daddy! Well, you don't disappoint her now, do you? We can't do that. What are you talking about? Well, it's just evil. <laughs> When I ask for rope, I expect to get rope. I'm gonna just go out and teach you a lesson. Daddy! He's gone into you! While you're under my roof, you'll do as I said you do. Okay. We gotta find a way out. Zoe! Open this door! No thanks. Stop it. I'll just be leaving now. Oh, we got Lucas. some concerns. I actually have a lot of concerns. Oh, Such a sweet little thing. Okay. No, that's fine. The darkness oh. is my friend. Ain't that sweet? I am borrowing it. I was not molded by it. I don't know what the crazy lady's gonna do, so...
So we're just gonna wait her out till I see a pattern. Are you there? Nope. Be gone, thought. No, oh, I got the hiccups. Hmm. Well, okie dokie then. Come out and meet her, Zoe. No thanks. She's just lonely, Zoe. And we gotta protect her. Do we, though? Even trying to do in here is the question. I don't like snakes. Zoe. Zoe. Just chill in here and see if there's anything to see. Okay, so it wants me to do that puzzle. It's missing the one head. thing to have. Feels like some Bioshock styled bullshit. I'm not seeing anything here. She wants me to go to the garage. That's locked. Something in the pantry is locked. Something upstairs is locked. Why is this happening? Zoe! <laughs> Zoe! I've been looking for you. Oh, no, it's fine.
Shut up! You ain't real! <laughs> and she and turns her head. Oh, we got one lockpick. My question is what to use it on. So am I shank a bitch? Come on then, Zoe. What am I doing with that? I mean I will shank a bitch, it's fine, but I'm just saying. I don't know where you're at, which is highly problematic. And here I go. Oh, that's not ideal. I'm trying to find a damn lockpick. That's not ideal. Get over here, Zoe. No thanks. Unless you can magically come here, I am. Which, if you can, I'm calling bullshit.
No, oh, looks like I can't climb back in. So that could be problematic. Debatable. I found you. No more running around. Why don't you get down here? No, I'm just trying to find a lockpick. Hmm. All right. Well, I don't see any lockpicks, and I've been through the entire house, so well, let's do this. Hi. Don't oh, not ideal. No, Holy fuck, buckets. Need to calm down there a little bit, my dude. Oh, yeah. Just one resolution. One way Zoe's struggles might have ended. Sometimes even just a small, wandering step can change your course altogether. You failed to lead Zoe on the true path. All right. Let's try it again, then. Yup. They haven't said. Up and at him. Marguerite, open up. Found another one. Oh. Oh, she's so young. Yeah. How's our other guest? Sleeping, poor thing. Oh, I say let him. He'll be okay here for a few days. At least was till we can get him into town. Zoe, go get some fresh clothes from the laundry room, okay? All righty. Looks like there's some sort of oil yeah. spill or something. Yes. Let's get this poor girl some fresh clothes and into a warm bed. Mm. We'll put her in Lucas's old room. Oh, come on. Can't you put her somewhere else? Oh, Lucas, you just hush. Long outgrown that room. Always want to run a bed breakfast. Got your big break, didn't you? <laughs> get her to bed. I'll put some soup on. Lucas, move the fuck out the way. Good enough for soup, don't you think? Excuse me. It's always a good night for soup. All right. Uh. Yeah, we'll take that. See if there's another one down here. Doesn't look like it. There's a change of clothes in the laundry room, dear. Working on it.
Move door, get the fuck out the way. Because that's what I actually use the lockpick on. Bunny, please get her cleaned up and into some dry clothes. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. The boathouse. It's half of the water last I looked. Yes, Daddy. Yeah. Got shit to do today. We'll get back to her in a second. So as we keep your dirty hands off my laptop, dum dum, while you're just jealous of my hacker skills, that you get for using the same password for your phone and your computer, dipshit. Fuck you list. The old man slapped me right in the face for checking my phone during dinner. Fuck you. I can't say one word about Ma's cooking without getting yelled at. Fuck you. All I did was look in on Zoe when she was doing yoga and she calls me a pervert. Fuck you. The old man, the old man got drunk and started throwing all my crap in that red box on the veranda. Fuck you. Alright, so... We need the veranda. I'm gonna trigger this little shithead. All right, little girl, let's get you cleaned up. They're mine now. Yeah, yeah, what? fuck you. Was a something strike. Where'd that little girl get to? What was that? Lucas? What happened? Are you okay? Come back here, crazy lady. What the hell's going on? Mama, is that you? Yeah, hey, how you doing? So, come look. Come see her gift. No, thank you. Look at all the pretties, my little girl is giving me. Kiss me, lover! Get to the garage! Get some rope! Go now! Get out of my way, Jack! Working on it. Come on. Let me wiggle in. I'm on my way, Daddy. Okay. So. Get the rope, get the fork, get on the veranda. Get to the red box. Daddy. 
is just a bath. It's a whole lot worse than it looks. Cleanliness is next to godliness. The young man is a good fucking good to meet him right now. She wants me to do this. I have to show her how to hold her. She wants us all to show her our love. Daddy! That's not you ideal. Point it, now, do you? We can't do that. What are you talking about? You don't exist even. <laughs> When I ask for rope, I expect to get rope. I'm not just gonna teach you to listen. Daddy! What's gotten into you? While you're under my roof, you'll do as I say you feel to me. We gotta find a way out. Making our way outside. Zoe! Open this door! Nope. We are out and about. It did say on the veranda, right? Oh shit. All right, so that's the thing we need for the door. I gotta get out of here. No shit. Now all we gotta do is wait for this crazy lady to move and we'll be all set. Oh, that Evelyn. Such a sweet little thing. Huh? No shit. Yeah, come on up. Come nice. on, meet her, Zoe. Damn it. Someone should come up. Sounds like mostly a you problem. Zoe! You're gonna make me mad! You could move the fuck out the way, that'd be great. Fuck off. You're gonna have a little sister, Zoe. Well, we did make it outside. This can't be real. 
Whether that means anything useful is yet to be determined. Let me hold my breath. All right. To the trailer! Quickly now! Mia's down. To the Baker family, thank you for saving my life, but please forget all about me. I was assigned to transport some important cargo on that ship. Getting involved with me or that cargo can only cause trouble for your family. Big trouble. Please don't contact the police or state authorities. Pretend we never met. And you saved me, so take this advice in return. The girl in that ship who looks about ten years old, don't approach her. She talks to you. Get away as quickly as you can. Just try not to make her angry in the process. If you've been feeling ill at all, then I'm afraid the worst has already happened. Fade worse than death, and I can't, and it can't be cured at the hospital. I'm so sorry. There is, there is a way to stop it. The though serum, if you inject, stop the sim. Okay. Mister. Oh no. <laughs> 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 oh no. I think I fell asleep. Well, well, now look who has decided to join us. Wake up and smell the shitty coffee, Zoe. Lucas. You okay, dear? The blood on your chest last night. seems to indicate otherwise. I, I had the weirdest dream last night. There was this little girl. Well, now, after breakfast, uh, Lucas and I are going to have a look around and see if the storm did any damage. You two should have a look around the house. <gasps> That's a good idea, Jack. You remember the last hurricane? We thought we were alone. And the next time it rained, there was a mess for sure. Uh. Hello, sister. Oh, no. Well, okay then. Now Zoe's mundane life has become a struggle for survival. She will spend her day slipping through the grasps of her now insane family, searching for the serum that Mia spoke of in her letter. Nights are marked by the family's murderous feasts, and Evelyn's body deteriorates as the months go by. Eventually, Zoe will encounter Ethan, her best hope at finding the serum. But she has a long way to go before that day. And so began the horror. Well. Oh, assuming that's the proper way to go about it. But uh, I go with that. I'm going to take a break again. So y'all stay safe out there. Have a good day. And I'll be back to continue in a little bit. <laughs>